Hello, hello. I'm going to show you some tips and tricks for Warrior Rule in Warrior Cats Ultimate Edition. Let's get into it. The most important part is reading and knowing the warrior code. Because before being a warrior, you learn this code by heart and you try to follow all of the code. If you're an evil warrior, then ignore all of the dang code. I'll show you where you can get the warrior code in Warrior Cats Ultimate Edition. Here it is. If it's too small, I'll put it in the video's description. A warrior. A apprentice who had been appointed to warrior duties and has been warrior for a little while or for a long time. As a warrior, you seek to help your clan, making sure all the queens, kits, and elders have food first before anyone else. And if you do see someone getting some food first unless the leader given, express permission for them to eat first without offering some to the elders, queens, kits, then that's against the warrior code. Put your clan first, then yourself. Warriors try to protect every clanmate, even if you hate them. It's against the warrior code if you leave your clanmate S to die. You as a warrior want to save all of your clanmates? It's your duties to keep the clan safe from danger. If you find yourself sitting in the clearing in front of the leader's rock, then just go on a small walk, maybe guard the exits for a bit, and if you still haven't found anything that you like, maybe offer some help to the elders, medicine cadets, or queens. But if you did found rogues living in your territory, then you want to stay quiet you don't want to alert them just yet. You want to let the leader, deputy, know about this since there might be more than you think and they might be stronger than you. That's to get some backup for a group of rogues. If you stumbled upon a loner, then you can either chase them out of the territory or bring them to your leader if the loner wants to talk with the leader. If you do bring the loner back to camp, you want to sit around? Because the leader might tell you to escort them out of the territory. And a tip, if you want to have a bit more fun, then look for someone to be your friend. They don't have to be your real friend out of RP, but it's good to talk to someone in RP. Or if you're feeling a bit dramatic, then try to make a enemy. It's always fun to stumble across your enemy's way. Did this help you? Like and sub to show it did. Thanks for 400 plus subs at one point. I'd never thought that I'll have more than 100 subs. Thank you so much, guys. I'm giving it in return by drawing your guys OCS. If you want to know more, check community post. That was legitness. Yeah, it was, huh?